nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we are go, go, go for the endurance race. Seven, five minutes, here we go. Chance of power racing is back the way. Farmer Nimi, Jimmy Meeting there, has a slight soul, so had PGH right behind them in catastrophe. Heck, he's going to have to activate his time, so he's going to get back in time to get a better start. It is still green. We are all good to go. And right now, Phantom Power Racing. Phantom Power is just crossing the line now. They had a real slow start. But it's not. It's just the beginning, folks. And Mayhem all over the place on the track. Ladies and gentlemen, directing your attention to number 48 and number 430, Nimby Ferrari. First and second right on top of each other. Nimby's having a look on the outside. Another accident by getting off the top. Oh, unbelievable. Those marshals are going to have to really clean that up. That might be a good looper uh, penalty by causing an accident by causing an accident. Alright, that, that's a good metaphor, actually. I'm not sure how you even penalize that. <laughs> All right, they're winding back up, they go on their way. I think they need to be reminded that this is a 75 minute race. Yeah, 75 minutes over. Pan's gonna take it back. It's green flag this time by. We have Mindy Ferrari in the lead with Chidi Niki Man in second place. Right there, that happy little man. Remember those Moxie points matter. Get those Moxie points in hat. Back to the future is fighting through the lap traffic already. They have a long way to go to make up from Chini Niki Man. For those of you watching, first place right there, second place right next to him, already pulling away from the rest of the pack. And Phantom Power Racing stuck in traffic with a third place right now. Followed by Contastrophe and Head to the Future in fifth. And it is intense, folks. There are quite a few quick cars out there. And right now they're navigating this battle of car path right over here. Maybe Ferrari right now setting the fastest pace off of. 16 seconds. That is incredibly quick. Most, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cars all within a second of each other. Yeah, the lap times are not reflecting that this is a 75 minute race. Someone needs to keep reminding these drivers they have a long way to go. Oh, 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 he blew a tire and spun out. Quite dramatic. That was uh, a big tire to go out. We're taking the green again this time by. Already quite a few incidences early on. Daniel Ungerhorn from your, your friendly team at I3 Detroit. Oh, it is completely packed in the back right now. The leader's tossing it up with the mid-level cars. And it is dicey back there. Really, the teams are going to have to really be careful, especially the lead ones if they want to survive this race. they got to stay out of trouble. But right now, the teams that aren't trying. Meanwhile, first and second place, Mindy Ferrari and Chidi Miki Man are putting on one amazing show for the lead. So early on. That red flag. And a pair of horse and Phantom and the head PGH are both into the wall back in the way. That is going to cost them. Meanwhile, Mindy on the inside, Chidi Miki Man, they're splitting by Tasha Big down the center line. Chidi Miki Man losing out on that one. And Tasha Big getting a little bit slower on the exit of that turn. Matilda had a penalty for causing an accident by causing an accident. This penalty was they had to high five two people in the crowd, but they're all over! All hands up to them. That's gotta be a post dialogue. Yeah, that's gonna be a big question. Probably get Matilda off of the shaft. Poor Matilda. Tell them, hey, Bill. 
Carter Spogo is the driver all right? Asher, was that both of the all-hands active cars at the same time? I think so, both of them are in are out. I can't believe it myself. That was quite the incident there. It looks like the battery pack also fell out when they flipped over. Yeah, that, that was a good tumble there. The driver is now inspecting his car, wondering what went wrong. And now as the liquid wrench pace car that makes their way around, it's going to pull in and we'll take the green as soon as it gets in. That's why we wear helmets, ladies and gentlemen, if you're in a little hurry out there. Oh, and Batmobile, we're still under caution. That car needs to get off the track immediately, Marshalls. Right behind you, Marshalls. Third Batmobile died on a caution lap. That's unusual. All right. Here. We're going to have to pull back underway. I want to warn everyone there's going to be a loud explosion in a couple seconds. Three times. And they're back underway. Ladies and gentlemen, first and second place for Wendy Ferrari and the Chini Minko van. They're on top of each other right now. Charles is going to look on the outside of Jimmy. Jimmy doesn't have enough power. He powers into the boat. The power slides. Unbelievable overtake from the MIT department of Sony Oak Parts. What a tremendous performance. Unbelievable overtake. Jenny just did not have the power for that. But Nicky Ferrari is not done yet. He's going to reel him back in. Meanwhile, Atomic Chibi, that red chief that's right there, is currently in third place. The Chibi Nicky Van locks up his wheels every time he breaks. He's going to make the tire as fast as he can take Chibi. Chibi has lost all the passion about low source Rex. Last couple of cautions earlier, I3 Detroit has actually managed to get up to fourth place while Galvano Chibi, I thought that Chibi is also attritioning on the track a couple times. This is already a bit, bit intense, and this is just the beginning. Iron Rose needs to get underway, and they do, while the leaders are coming through. I3 Detroit, the champion. And then before I on the outside, as far outside as you possibly can go. And there's a You can't even pass there. I've never seen a pass there in all five years of racing in Detroit. An impossible overtake by Wendy. And Charles is looking on the inside of the MIT Department of Sun Oak Hearts. Wendy Ferrari, Shuri, Nikki Van. Both of them are right on top of each other. Nobody seems to have told them that this is an endurance race. But 75 minutes, these guys left the race. We have seven minutes to go before our first driver change. That's right. Seven minutes. Every single one of these guys has to put and change drivers or change costumes. Pastor, this is incredible. I've never seen the front runners run this hard this early before. Look at Vance and Paul Racing. It's inside right wheel. That's tired up all over it. The paint from the right walls are gone. It's already taken battle damage. And right now, they're in the top five. Patrick, give me a breakdown on what's going on out there. His first place right now is Mindy. Second place is Chibi Nikobat. Third place now is I3 Detroit. Just going to put Phantom. Fifth place is Catastrophe. I3 Detroit having an amazing performance right now. They're staying out of trouble, which is something that Phantom and Catastrophe have both run into, as, as well as Hack to the Future. Okay. Where is Hack to the Future right now, Patrick? Back to the Future. Back to the Future is unfortunately in sixth place. Sixth place? That's really far back for them, so that early contact really cost them. Jimmy Nikki Van, screaming on the inside. Is there any room there? Al Nuffler no, isn't enough room for Lucky 13. I'm luckily into the wall. Getting out of the way nice and clear. Meanwhile, the battle leaders here. Chibi Miku then had a really close look at Nimby Ferrari. And they didn't get the job done. Jamie slammed the door in that turn. An amazing performance by both of them right now. Cartesian and Phantom also in the battle together. With Back to the Future keeping them completely honest. And Chibi Miku then on the inside. And completes the pass. An incredible overtake. Very close to what he did the first time. 
today. And there's just cars passing everywhere, folks. It's almost impossible to keep track. Chidi Miki Man now your leader in the 75 minute endurance race. But Lindy Ferrari constantly having to work every single turn, fighting corner after corner. And we see one of these cars is about two seconds slower than the fastest lap. They're getting into a rhythm for endurance. That's right, Patrick. It's amazing. Chidi Miki Man is trying back and forth. Lindy Ferrari, every chance it gets. He is all over the track, but she didn't let him through that easily. And yet, this is just the beginning of the endurance race. But in the middle on the inside, door slammed by Chidi Niki Man. Four minutes of driver change, four minutes of driver change. Chidi Niki Man is under attack yet again. Mindy Ferrari keeping the Miku van on full attack mode. There is no holding back in this race so far. A lot of boom will happen. It looks like all hands are starting to get back onto the track. And meanwhile, Ferrari has another with Mindy Ferrari tries again. So close. Not enough. They're fighting with Mini Monsters, the winning car on the inside, passing through. Meanwhile, Fenton has gotten away from catastrophe. But right now, it's the two leaders that are doing an incredible show. Both of these cars are absolutely on the limit. I can't believe it myself. And it looks like Johnny, the driver of Nimby, is sizing up the Chiginiki man. He just gave him a threatening glare. That's how it's flowing. Patrick, I think uh, I saw a Luigi duck glare coming out of uh, the Ferrari. And that's that good. And he's looking on the inside, they touch just slightly, and they're back on the way. There's some incredible racing going on today. Three minutes of driver change, three minutes. Right now, Matt PGH is trying to claw away back from their early mishap. But right now, they're not under full place. They're playing a different pitch strategy, ladies and gentlemen. Matt PGH, Back to the Future, as you know them, are the team that is going to be not going to fill out. Oh, and meanwhile, Lucky 13 had a can in the wall. How oh, unfortunate. Well, I might have been wondering that the part of the series is bucking, but I think we're going to have some fantastic merchandise available at the merchandise tent over here. We buy the stands. The official tickets, prices, and so much more. Yeah, I love my prices. If we look back to the leaders, Patrick, I, I, I can't take my eyes off of them. They're constantly trying to overtake each other. Nimby Ferrari looking every single chance they get. Back and forth. Charles is, Charles is a distracted. Nimby Ferrari gets around him. This is a big problem. He's got a problem. He's got his hand in the air. I think he's got an issue. You know what? It's Fubon. That's uh, right. He's got a problem that Fubon is stuck in the wall. Yeah, that's slowing up there for a small caution. Meanwhile, our leader is going a bit of a dramatic issue. That's going to cost him a massive amount of time, especially because Nimby Ferrari, who are like, walking the tra car off the track now. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause for Fubal Ash all the way from New Jersey. They're having some bad luck now, but it's not over yet. This is just the beginning of the race. Right. They have plenty of time to fix it, to get the car back underway. But then, meanwhile, Nimby Ferrari is now the leader as Chidi Nikogan comes and runs into the pits with some major issues. One minute to driver change, one minute to driver change. Our first driver change of the day, and right now, Nimby Ferrari is in first place. But unbelievable, their consistency is paid off. I play Detroit. Your hometown heroes are now in second place as Chidi Nikogan has started themselves into the pits. Meanwhile, we have Cartastrophe in third, Hacks the Future in fourth, and Phantom Power Racing in fifth. Chidi Nikovan is back out in sixth place now. We have a few seconds left until the driver change, ladies and gentlemen. The first stint of today's endurance race. I know it doesn't look like an endurance race right now because these teams are running completely on the limits. Meanwhile, the team are on the limit of their tires, hopping worries everywhere they can. Judy Nikovin is going to have a lot of time to make up. Oh, the damn caution is out. Oh, they're holding over a bend. 
That can't keep happening for them. That is some tough luck for them right now. That is unfortunate. And back we're going to have a driver change now, too. Uh, driver change. Driver change. When you guys come back out, we're going to have the green flag. All right, so we had some early changes right now. Mid before A, all the way to get in. And Batman's got a broken car and he's looking for Moxie. What a tremendous strategy by Nimi Floyd, they pull in as the caution. Batman Floyd doesn't work, he's looking for Moxie from anyone who will help him. Where's my Moxie going? That's it. I'm in here in the piss cells with, with Chibi Miku Van. Charles just got out of the car and screamed, I need a drill bit. The face of the Chibi Miku Van is broken off. The little magnetic smile face is now a frown. I'm not sure what's going to go on with the car now, but they're changing the atomic Chibi as we speak. I go in there hard as a pit at the same time. I now have three Detroit's back out and putting laps on them. So does that PGH also back out. But right now the drama is in the Chibi Miku Van pits. Everyone's coming back out of the pits. With the new drivers, some of new batteries. 